Today marks the dawn of a new era. More responsibility as the SEC reporting manager. It feels good. It's nice to have a win for once. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, is that right? This thing has got a mouth on it. Ching ting chow! Ching ting chow! Ching ting chow! If it didn't get 26 miles to the gallon, I would return it in a heartbeat. Hi, Sheriff. Jamie here. Uh, yeah, more Telsa troubles. It is headed onto Coldwater Canyon. I think it's headed for the 170, and it's angry. I didn't talk back to it. <laughs>
I want to do that once Sarah started working here. Oh. Oh, man. I am so proud of her, dude. I'm so proud of Sarah, man. She got this job, bro. And that's just like what everybody wanted. You know, we all wanted her to get that job. Man, I'm, I'm peaking right now, dude. Contrary to popular opinion, accountants, we're not, just, we're not just sitting around all day crunching numbers, you know, on our Excel spreadsheets, just putting in assets, liabilities. I mean, yeah, maybe we do technically do all that stuff, but also, we have emotions, dude. And sometimes, those feelings get kind of dark. You know that movie with all the little animated emotions running around that girl's head? I feel like that's how I'm seeing myself right now, but there's a little grayish black emotion in there, and he's playing Alanis Morissette. Like, why'd she have to do that? Like, why'd she have, like, she, everything was so good. Everything was so good. It's like raining all the time. It just feels like, why is it always raining in my heart? Everything was so great. Getting out of bed this morning was hard. I mean, it's because I have a weighted blanket, so it takes a while every morning. Everything's still great, bro. Sarah's got this job. I don't have to be with her as much anymore. And it's, I don't even care. What, dude, I don't. First day, thought I'd hang by the water cooler, make some friends. Things are going pretty smooth so far. A little too smooth, if you ask me. <laughs> this elephant's got a long memory, all right? I know how it works around here. I know the pranks, the teasings. It all started in high school. I got pantsed at a pep rally. It was the highlight of many people's high school careers. And ever since that day, I wear seven pairs of underpants every single day. So good luck pantsing me. Good luck undressing me. I can't tell you how many times I've missed out on a romantic encounter because time ran out. <laughs> no one's pranking me today. Hey, hey, hey. You know it'd go pretty well with that coffee? Some donuts from my kid's school. You son of a bitch. I'm not having it! Oh! You're naughty. And I don't appreciate it, and I would expect more on day one, okay? Than something like this. I think I was born yesterday. I don't know when you were born. A gentleman never tells or asks. I'll tell you this, I'm older than you. Oh. I had a flight of PTA, Mom, for you. Hey, sorry I'm late. Had a bit of a zipper negotiation. Uh, no, no, no worries. Um, uh, please come in, sit wherever you want. Oh, wow. wow you went all out. This is like... This is great. Well, I mean, there's there's other people coming. They'll be here in a minute. Casino, walk out the event. I'll go. Later, haters. Or not. Don't give up. You know, this new expense platform is like the Jay-Z of, of expense platforms. It's like accountants in Paris out here. Seriously, that's what I thought. Sales doesn't really respond to meetings in general. They're more driven by eatings. Uh, free food, ETC, means etc. Thanks, Marty. Oh, it pressing my buttons. Oh, oh no, you've been electrocuted. Trust compressions, you're back to life. So what, Sarah's just like exploring other love interests and like didn't communicate that to me? This is tough to watch, dude. I can't imagine how you're feeling right now, man. Seeing your girl drip over a dude named Marty. I want to party with Marty. I would be devastated, especially after she just destroyed you publicly, dude. Gutted, fatality, no point in living. Fatality. How do you even know about that? I see everything, man. That's how I pass my time. You watch the whole thing? Who watches The Watchmen? IT does. We have a camera in the women's bathroom. Shut up, Tim. You're the one that told me to put it there. Shut up, Tim. So what, what do I gotta do? Like dress like I work at Brooks Brothers and then Sarah will start liking me again? Like what does it take? Sarah's like a rose. Roses grow best with well-drained soil, mm. rich in organic matter. Mm. Stop letting him listen to R&B. Can we focus on the objective, please? Tim, this is killing me. Can we watch something else? Hunter, Hunter, look, there, Jamie. He's outside, alone, consuming dairy during the autumnal equinox on the eve of the full corn moon. We can finally carry out the Hogwarts letter prank. This kind of opportunity comes once every 50 years. Hunter, if not for me, if not for Sarah, do it for science. Hunter. 
Oh yeah, he left like 45 seconds ago. He did no. text me though. Michaela, I'm feeling a little too sad for this prank stuff. Three black heart emojis, tear face emoji, money tongue, tear face. How many black heart emojis? A holy trinity of black heart emojis. This man's in DEFCON 5 sadness. How many DEFCONs are there exactly? Con it is stops that bad? at five. Holy shit, this is bad. This is really bad. Sarah! Hunter? Oh, hey, Sarah. I didn't even see you there. Hunter, did you eat some black licorice? Here. You want this? It's kind of like all over. Look, Sarah, look, I know we haven't had like time to chat lately or whatever, because we got this new job, but if you could just like come into the conference room for like five seconds, we'd love to just get some things off my chest. I'm, I'm just really busy. I don't, I don't think I have time. You don't have time. You don't have time. Yeah, I know that makes sense. Uh, but you know, it's really important that you just. It would take like five seconds if we could just go to the Look, conference room. I made something for you, and I just think it'd be really nice if I could show you what it is, and that'd be great. I'm just. I'm trying to put together this gift for the sales team. I've got handwritten notes and muffins in the oven. It's Nana's secret recipe. So. You made them Nana Mendelssohn's secret recipe? Yeah. Heartbreak. Um. Can all this just wait till later? I don't know. Can my heart wait? What? What? I didn't I don't say, say anything. anything. You're you were the, the one, one who said say, say. I just don't really have time. But why don't you just keep rolling with this, and uh, I'll talk to you later. Sorry. <sighs> so I guess that's it. Sarah's made her choice. It's obvious. It's not me. It's just freaking sales bros, I guess. She gave him Nana's recipe. That's basically like a giving her a hand in marriage or whatever. I honestly don't even know what I did wrong. So what, I just like didn't go get an expense report one time and she has to just like break my heart 7,000 times? <laughs> Been leveraging my pain in a bunch of ways, finding new artistic outlets. Been doing some drawing. Yeah, that's how I feel on the inside right about now, dude. Just keeping it real, you know? I don't know, I've been making a bunch of angry TikToks. They're doing pretty well. Emo talk is hot right now. Been doing like some sculpting. Like I'll chew a bunch of gum angrily. I put a bunch of jaw into it and I'll spit it all out. And I'll make some fing like angry blob and that's just like how I feel, you know? Those aren't doing so well. And then like the rest of my angry emotions I just like leveraged into song, you know? Just like been making a couple tracks. I got one, it's pretty good. It's not finished, but I'll show you whatever. I'll show you. I'll show you, Sarah! Sorry, I had to find it. Anyway, yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. Check, check, check! Check, 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 check! Check, check, this goes out to you, Sarah! You broke my heart! I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I allocated time to you. Your love for me depreciates. And now I'm forced to liquidate. First day you were all alone. We brought you in, gave you a home. But then in front of everyone, you slide me. My portrait saw the pages in my diary. Solvency, insolvency. Like I said, it's not finished yet, but like it's some slides getting there. It's not Mr. Master, but it will be. Nothing's ever perfect. All right, you're 10 seconds into the call with General McGinty. What do you ask? Well, before I say anything, I turn on my phone voice. And then I ask, Jenny, baby, how's the weather up in Poughkeepsie? 43 degrees with a chance of rain. Ooh, I feel that. In Los Angeles, it's horrible. Well, it's, you know, 72 degrees, but it's literally on fire. Remind me, you still ice fishing up there? Sure am. It's dank as Oh. <laughs> Talk dirty to me, Jenny. What I wouldn't give to dust off the old rod. But I mean, let's be honest, probably wouldn't catch shit because I suck at sports. Remind me, 
How many kids do you have? Two boys, one girl. Are you kidding me? Same. Samson's on the fast track to Juvie. Bella totaled my Jag last week. Such a bitch. <laughs> and what about the boy? Well, he wants to go into marketing. <sighs> Wait, you have kids? Dude, no. I hate kids. Almost as much as I hate the IRS. I just have 14 photo variations mm. for any sales situation. See, the key in this game is to build rapport. We got a foolproof system for it. It's called whack. Weather, activity, kids. Okay, so you whack every client? Dog, I whack every single one. Does Deborah know about this? Duh! Who do you think taught me how to whack this good? <laughs> oh. Mommy did! <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, that's whack! Oh my god. Hey guys! I know you were all too busy to come to the meeting earlier today because of the offsite at the casino. And that's totally cool. Um, so, in honor of your big pitch, I brought you some homemade all natural protein muffins. The perfect pregame snack. And a picture of sales legend Vincent Offer signed by Mr. Shamwow himself. Oh my God, I love this guy. I used to watch his commercials when I was trying to watch the Girls Gone Wild commercials. His commercials were good too, but they were, you know, just different vibes. He also did the slap chop. Yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, I guess this is pretty rad or whatever, but you know, stop. As much as I would love to nom these muffs, I just don't know if we're gonna have time. No, hey, hey, no worries. You know, after you crush the pitch, I I'd love to chat with you guys about the new expense platform. It's super easy to use, and it'll make all of our lives a lot easier. Yeah, sure, sounds sick. Okay. Cool. <laughs> cool. All right. Sick. Oh well, um, make that bank, right? Crush that pitch down the line. <laughs> nice, amazing. I'm so pumped for you guys. You're gonna kill it. Right? Like that? Okay. Bye, guys. Well, this is pretty fire. Yeah? Oh, look, she added little notes, too. Rico, my guy. You can do anything you put your mind to. Love, Sarah. Dude, I feel so seen right now. That's so sweet. Maybe she's not so bad. <clears throat> <clears throat> All right, gang, let's saddle up. But... What's up, dude? You good? You need some milk? <laughs> Dude, Lance! What the f is that? Lance! Somebody call an ambulance! Rico's here! Oh, what are their symptoms? I'm on hold with WebMD. WebMD, that's a fing website! Okay, okay, okay. Hey! It says here we gotta open this airway with the tent. All right, I'm coming in! No! Get out of the way, Rico! No. It's gonna be okay, honey, all right? It's gonna be all right. I'm here. I'm not gonna leave you. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck happened? He had a severe allergic reaction. Oh my god. Oh, jeez. He looks horrible. Oh. An allergic reaction to what? To gluten, or rather the lack of it. <laughs> He's allergic to glutenless foods, and apparently he ingested some gluten-free muffins. Mm -hmm. We need to get him to the hospital ASAP for a gluten transfusion, or he's gonna lose a leg, damn it. Buddy, what are we gonna do? I, I, I did this. It's all my fault. Hey, hey, no. If anyone's going down for this, it's me. I'll gladly go to jail. Someone's going to jail? If someone has to, I'm prepared. Oh my god, I will not leave you, honey. Ooh, I have a Zoom happy hour. Ooh, Rico. Lance, you, you called for me. Oh, my sweet prince. I'm here, I'm here for you, King. Don't take the pitch. Take the pitch. Okay, I can do this, I got this. No, Rico, close, own the call. Own the call. No. I got this. Rico, hey, hey. You save your energy, King. King, I need you to save that energy, okay? I'm gonna make you proud. It's the best day of my life. I'm out of here. Woohoo! Really hope he doesn't lose the leg. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, Bruce? If we're going to St. John's, let's not take La Cienega. I do not have the time. <clears throat> All right, I'll make it easy on you. What do you say? Cut this up. What are you doing? Bruce! It wasn't for me. The ambulance wasn't for me. <laughs> I did, the whole thing happened. The sirens came, the truck arrived, Bruce and Maria jumped out, and then, I don't know. It wasn't for me. <laughs> uh.
Everything's coming up, Jamie. I got four and a half hours of sleep last night. I mean, Ms. Whiskers and Little Lavender, my cats, weren't clawing at my eyes. <laughs> I mean, I'm thriving. General, what the f is up, my dude? <laughs> How's the weather in Poughkeepsie, baby? Nice, nice. Okay, rainbow trout. All right. Yeah, I, uh, I've caught a couple sunfish in my day. <laughs> so your wife, she's hot. Yeah, Deborah. Hold on, honey. A sweet girl in a loud dress needs me. One sec. I am so sorry about Lance. I, I didn't know about his allergy, but I I'm sure that Rico's gonna do great on the pitch to Halliburton. Wait a second. Wait a second. Are you saying the BDR is doing the demo solo with Halliburton? Uh -huh. Honey, I watched that kid try on a hoodie for 10 minutes. He couldn't find the neck hole. So he gave up. My God. I'm so fricked. Why does this happen to me all the time? What am I gonna do? I wish this was like a game show, you know, like who wants to be a millionaire? You could phone a friend or something. Wait. I can phone a friend, because I have a friend now. Hey, Lindsay, oh my god, you answered. What's up, girl? Look, I'm in a little bit of a situation at work. Sarah? How did you get this number? Maybe we could meet for coffee, finally hang out. I, I can't talk right now. I'll talk to you later. Hi, um, were you followed? No, I, I don't think so. Okay, good. How soon did you say we get that material weakness downgraded to a significant deficiency? Well, that depends on how many reasons you're giving me. Is this enough reasons? I will update my recommendation immediately. It's a done deal. Pleasure doing business with you. Ah, but first, I'm gonna need you to count the money. All of it. Are you nuts? I'm not gonna sit here and count $200,000 for you. Freeze, asshole! FBI. You're under arrest for bribery. Conspiracy and fraud. Cuffer oh, Frank. Shit, not again. Rodriguez, Rodriguez, you know the drill. Oh, man. Fancy running into you here, Denise. How are your kids? They're 10 and 12 now? How's your ex wife doing? Oh. That cuts, Denise. Whatever. Thank Johnson, you, Frank. get that briefcase to evidence. <sighs> I love being an auditor. <sighs> Do you love ramen? No way. You gotta be kidding me. I see her right now. Sarah? Conference room. Now! Jessica, I am so- So let me get this straight. Sales refused to use your expense platform, so you poisoned the top rep? Well, um, I wasn't exactly- That's what I'm talking. Wow, that's old school. I love it. You gotta text me your poison muffin recipe. You you want me to text you? Thought you were spineless, but you are ruthless, just like me. <sighs> wow. Oh, sorry. Did that's that hurt? Me. No, no. It's good. Because I'm ruthless. I don't care. If you I are. hurt you. Yeah. Okay, so maybe it was an accident, and maybe someone went into anaphylactic shock and repeatedly flatlined at the hospital where they were legally pronounced dead, but the doctor said he will probably make a full recovery. It's a 50-50 chance. But, hey, a win's a win, right? And to make it right, I sent a care package of extra gluten muffins to the hospital for Lance. And I'm sending his mom updates on Facebook. They actually haven't talked in years, so it was a little awkward, but I'm hoping they can work it out once he gets the tube out of his mouth and he can talk again. I mean, obviously I knew things would change when Sarah became AOM, but I didn't think things would change that much. Ricky, dude, you're like a relationship expert. How do you protect your heart? I don't. <laughs> I miss the pool and pray. Yeah, I know, dude. I follow you on Snapchat, but that's not what I mean. You mean when everything goes wrong, I change my name, burn my stuff, and move two towns over. <laughs> or I write a letter, like the cute one I found today in the trash. What? <laughs> Yo, what? These are the letters that Sarah made for the sales team. She put so much effort into these. And they just threw them away? Those assholes. Those assholes. 
those assholes. Somebody should teach them a lesson. Yeah, but who? Those are my clothes, the only clothes. I uh, should've thought this through. Yo, what size shirt is that, medium? Let me borrow it real quick, permanently. Come on, man, look me, my nipples are out. Is there a Nordstrom's rack nearby? Please, no. This isn't about me. I just, you know, I'm, I'm just really glad that we were able to save Hunter. I was this close to staging a music venture. I had one myself five years ago, saved my life. I really don't tell many people this, but, um, I used to be a believer. Obviously, I'm like way past that now. Hey, girl. Shh, shh, Justin, you're beautiful, and also your phone is ringing. That was the Democratic Party. My vote is really important to them, so I should call them. I should call them back. So this is my band. This is Frowning Sabbath Daddy. This guy to my left is blah, blah, blah. It changes every day. Yesterday it was blah. We're playing Warp Tour this year. We haven't like booked it yet or whatever, but like we followed the guy who does the booking on Instagram. We've been liking all his photos and we put it on our nightmare board. That's like a vision board. So we're definitely trying to like manifest it from the Dark Lord. Met these guys on LinkedIn. You know, we linked up one time for Froyo and it was like history from there. You know, actually Frown Daddy, we are in the same Hebrew school. And my boy, ah, he actually teaches drum lessons to kids with no kneecaps. It's like really nice of him. The whole band's super charitable. It's a write-off.